not from that platoon. If anything, have a platoon in your mind before she leaves. Force my life as a person. She pure, kind, brave, she was a survivor, and I'll probably owe her my life. Uh, I can tell you to love her. More than anything. Oh, she, she's 19. Don't talk about her in the past tense. She'd be fucking quick. Y'all should do anything for her. We were close. We grew up together. The parents went early. Uh, was she ever into drugs? No, she didn't do that shit. She didn't need that shit to be happy. She was strong. I'm sure she still is. The strongest. Anything happened between you and Marty before she went missing. Why are you implying punk? I fight most of the stress. Maybe she was acting weird. Now things are good. I suppose her friend had just gone missing. Who? I think her name was Rose. Marty knew her well. They worked together. Yeah, thinking about it, I think she was the first one who started the fight. Okay, so that's some information. I remember that Rose is the one that started all the girls at the fighting shit. Maybe the other girls know something. Trust me, I've tried to leave no dice. So how long was Maya at the fight? A couple months, it felt like forever. What was her job there? She started off as a racer. She got promoted within a couple months. She talked much about what happened. Yeah, to what? She wouldn't tell me. She just said that she worked upstairs. Did she change after the promotion? She seemed prouder. Yeah, she was doing good, I guess. Maybe you know, I was taking over her own. Or how short we're going to touch it. Maybe I'll fucking kill you. Oh. That must be me out loud. Other people are just gonna have a bad and get you hurt. You both want the same thing. I suppose you could be asked when it works right, but you have the same call. Makes sense, makes sense. The timing has to be right before you can't make sense when I'm out went like you. What's the plan? Let's put up, watch our backs, buy our time, I'll give you a lead to chase. What's the lead partner? The first one, and that went missing. Rose, Rose Kaminko, she must have started off go talk to her mom, who's her mom. You're dumb, good that you have me, her name is Horn, she's crazy as fuck. And a mastermind like you must know where she is. Again, I feel like she's the character from the first. I mean, from the... And a, ma and a mastermind like you must know where she is. I can't do a thing myself, ask her mom. Alright, partner, let's do it. Chill like after. I've been chill. It's been real. I'll get the fuck out of here. I'm going. Damn it. Call Renee. Ah, so you admit it. Which is him or judging? Admit what? I was just minding my manners like old mother full time. Come on, mobile phone.
Sam Kahuna, Perfect Miss Miss Daughter, Leslie was friends with Samson's sister, Smile, he's a lot. Okay, yeah, that would be some useful context. Samson turned out to be the paranoid schizophrenic. Mai listened to him, worked with the bike. All of them did. So there's a connection. The first one who we mentioned is Rose Flamenco. You need to find her mother. You know how? Not yet, I'll figure it out. Go be social where everyone knows everyone there, right? Seems like it must be nice. Yeah, canonizing in between works. I don't have to, you don't have to live there, you have a new home. Truly bad friend. Sister is missing. I think Florence's daughter was the first one to see this. Sister's in line. I know where you're from around here. Mayor Rose, her daughter. My, my sister knows that she knew Rose Kaminko. Good winner. She was a pretty She was a pretty little leech. Mm. What do you mean? Sucked the life out of the hood. Tried to suck me in J2. We ain't falling for her shit. Working at the bite, you mean? Yeah. You gotta be really desperate to go there, not us, mister. Nah. I don't want anyone else to go missing. I can't help. Desperate. Just want to talk to Florence. If you're upset, Florence, I will fucking find you and skin you alive. You're hurt. I get it. I kill for my loved ones, too. Loud and clear. She's at the factory, like always. Don't tell her I told you. Thank you for trusting me. Yeah, make me wish I had it, and I will make you wish you had it. You get me. Right the fact that down the alley you can see it from here. Thanks. So, don't you think I'll look over and over? You tell me my daughter, I really look at her. You were good to me the other day. I looked through her stuff, I asked everyone nothing. Come on, we're on the road, couldn't miss it. How did she start to fight? Went there and asked for a job, that's all she told me. You gotta go to see her brother from here in a minute. Where do you live? Now come talk to me, come over and talk later. First time this letter across the road, you wanna see Rosie's room? Yes, that would help a lot. Yeah, I'm fine, we can sneak out now before the super is here. Let's go fire at you quick. Tell me about Rose. My baby girl is so sweet, strong, always took care of her mama. She wanted the best for me, but you know, she had any secrets hiding her place in the apartment. Go on. No, nah, it's nothing. I'm not here to judge, okay? She respected me, but she didn't want to follow in my footsteps. If I died more for us, maybe. 
maybe. Uh, don't go blame yourself. You did nothing wrong. And we didn't always talk as much as I might as we might have. I get so tired from work. She didn't want to burden me. Uh, still not your fault. She's so much more creative than me. Clever too. I don't know where she got that from. Did she ever stay anywhere else? No, nah, I mean um, only some other 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 girls' places. We didn't have much. Her, her room was special. She called it the Dream Palace. Always had a way with words. Thanks, I'll get lucky. Okay, just put stuff back where you found it. I want to keep my baby girl room tight. Of course. Much cozier than the rest of the house. I guess Rose never missing. They're going to come home soon. Poor Florence. Okay, she got a computer. Poster. Going to do a computer. Welcome, Rose. And your password. And the password was a different password, correct? The That exploded. Where did this music just come from? What what the hell? Keep singing. I, I don't know. How much of it? Let me see. Can I can I get out of this? From, from the information they give me here. Small heart. Genius Rosa and then the Rosa Rose plants range inside. 
Like a compact miniature rose is a climate that can be seen in the air. Rose prickles are typically sickle shaped hooks, which aid the rose in hanging onto other vegetation and growing over it. Heart leaf, philodendron, dendron, Flower plant is a family of right. Parts of the plant contain calcium oxalate crystals in varying concentrations. The plant is known to have a narcotic effect on rodents. What's that white flower called again? Bellis Prince. How the hell am I supposed to know this? The one she got in her room, I'm assuming then? The yellow ones? What's the yellow one called? Fell on the drain? Rose? Great fire flowers due to heavily featuring a myth of creation. But I tried rolls, so. How are you supposed to notice? Just go with the fucking... Well, I definitely can't pronounce whatever the fuck that is. A pretty bird. Sometimes there's blood inside and outside of my body. I wish I 
I could wash it away, but today, no water runs in the bathtub. It doesn't feel me. It doesn't touch my shoulders, my knees, or my thighs. So they're silently waiting, breathing, letting the air in. She made, she made a lick for tears. Empty envelopes, nothing in between. I am others. Today is Thursday. I'm sick of being bold and the way my voice breaks when I say a thing without meaning it. I used to sing in my head, but the theater is now full and the audience comes and goes. For instance, I never see the same face twice. Forgetting makes it easier, therefore I remember the music and not the lyrics. Would you like to have some soup? Not really. I'd rather try the main course. The doctor says it's good for your imagination. Like that time we're slicing through and grinding and chewing and speaking, the flesh speaks too, saying I am, I am, I am. So she writes poetry. Leslie, I love you. I am taken by this newfound multifaceted moving force commanding me in all directions. There was a gaping void inside my body and expanded space within, left empty, waiting to let in bigger things. Nothing escaped and nothing gravitated around the hole. I just sat there without desire, pronouncing the meaningless noise of existence. And then, out of nowhere, love returned and encompassed the whole of my being. What was once me now demands a new definition, new borders, new opening, new coping mechanism. I come up with new words, invent new ways to communicate with the widening world in front of the eyes that were once blind. Now I know. We spoke about our future and how it's impossible, but I found a way. Boss knows about us. She mentioned the scavenger that helps people like you and me. There's life beyond the wall, and I want to live it with you. Let me know. I am going to stay with you. Whatever you decide. Huh. So they read away? Leslie. Huh. So wait. She was she was gay? How do I get out of this? Oh wow. Now something happened. Clients. Okay. Interior security. Buster Carpenter and security. Security thug, official title is VIP public appearance liaison, complete asshole, good whiskey, monkey butt, always trying to touch the girls, brag about who you've been bodyguard to, mainly mid-level politician who have been doing things that they shouldn't have been, good source of tip-offs, keep happy. Frederick Mueller, accountant, creepy accountant, talks very little, doesn't bother the girls directly, but stares, no one likes him. Luckily, he's a lightweight, passes out after a few, has mentioned that he manages funds for a few apes since science minister included, mm. and hinted at knowing about the finances of the bike, hoping he'll slip up and overshare at some point. Blacklisted, weighs money around like it's nothing, science fan city family, but hasn't been. A great source of information, probably doesn't know anything anyway, possessive prick, got aggressive and started raising his hand at both girls and other customers, boss threw him out. Says she had ways of dealing with him. If he ever comes back, good riddance. Hmm. Warren Wolf. Police chiefs talk shit about interiors and security. Also, companies about science minister having him by the balls. Runs his mouth, but not much useful so far. Likes to be baby talk. Asks Gina to try to track specifics about his relationship with science minister. Guy Silver. Sliver. Hmm. Science minister, be careful, respectful of girls, drink only in moderation. Secretive, enters through the back alley, only ever request Leslie. Boss is a direct liaison, no one else allowed to speak to him. 
see to know boss well leslie doesn't like talking to people talking about him leslie spilled he mentioned project artifact once and then shut down investigation Traffic minister, reserved among people loud and arrogant with the girls, has at least two lovers beside his wife. Wow. Brags about his close working relationship with science minister, but obviously never sees him at the club. Only drinks sweet stuff, no whiskey or beer. Very clearly tries to avoid the specific of his work, but Leslie might be able to get something out of him. So what is Leslie like in this? Is he like a, a what they have in Japan, the the bar girls like he works at a cafe or some shit lawyer I mean she clearly works at the bite which is I don't know it's kind of like a cafe it's a strip club what is this uh, lawyer has a thing for Gina married with children does monkey butt like he's sipping on tea uh that's dude that's yeah that's white that's that's the Chick husband that got killed, right? Like he's sipping on tea, harmless for a lawyer. So Gina's a good fit, owns his own firm, deals almost exclusively with Ape and High City officials, has visited both Furt and Stokes. Eddie Hung, head of biochemistry at Biochemistry Lab at Science City. Family man likes to get drunk and cry on the girl's shoulder. Seems terrified of science minister. Boss told us to keep him sweet. Seeing Ball speaking directly to him when she thought he was alone, he looked depressed. Mentioned Project Artifact to baby Gina. That's twice now. Must be working on this with the minister. There's clearly something exciting going on uh, down at Science City that needs to tell Renee. John Stokes, treasurer, insufferably smug. Insufferably smug, I'm sorry. Food and drink is never good enough, but he keeps ordering the same thing. Everyone hates him, but he throws tips around left and right. Definitely spends money other than his own. Came in with Mueller a few times. Asked for private rooms. Tried to listen to me, but then he catch my terse conversation. Dream Team, Rose Kaminko. It's me, angry lady with the big butt. <laughs> patient with men. Maybe too patient. High drug sales. Oh, they in here serving. Not sure how that happened. Sensitive. Try not to give her rowdy men. Not a factory girl. Moved to the West End recently. Iron note. Sweet girl, but not the brightest. Looks young, look petite. Fills a gap in our list. Baby Gina. Factory girl. Close to my louder. Uh, Leslie Fong. Okay. Close to my with her mother. Lives with her mother and her a little brother. Roots in the area. Okay. Smart girl should fit in quickly if hired with Mai as a friend. Beautiful, when she enters the room, it feels like a summer day, the room where she swims the other way. Mm. So wait, so Rose end up falling in love with Leslie? Hmm. Factory girl, Leslie's best friend, very reserved, hiring her. May need coaching on how to handle clients, she's a stunner, all right, her brother is possessed and tells the counselor to watch out for him. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Stage one version three final team higher attractive loyal girl that know how to make me a talk start the factory click while the west end area offer good pay no sex work just listening flirting and reporting to me uh, okay intel boss has access to monkey butt supply helps loosen tongues mix 50 50 with hype to make addictive 75 25 on a hook to make them spill never let any girls try it sources create super exclusive Rose had a system that wasn't good at all. Clarissa, I feel sick. sick. Mm. Sources create super exclusive VIP brand to attract the big boys. Reward the guarantee access to favorite girls. Make sure girls make notes on dirt immediately. So, 
This bitch is just in here trying to get dirt on these guys so she can blackmail them. So this shit is this shit is wild. And but she drugging them though, like hey. Clarissa is dirty as hell, bro. Make sure girls immediately after session for my eyes only. Dead beats. Boss will send up candidates. Get one or two special girls to get them hooked and find out if they ever missed. And be right sidelines for girls when we're sure. Invite them to the room too with the painting and call Sue's. Hmm. Contact name Dio. Meet under the bridge on the 5th. At 12, she'll take us beyond the wall. Password Daisy Boom. Okay, Daisy Boom, remember that. Did you learn anything at all? What now? Why was she hiding? I don't know. Because it was blackmail material and plenty of it. I did always tell her to look after her own back, good girl. So do you think she's alive? I think she's gone into hiding. I believe so. I have to. I just want my baby girl back, however long it takes. I don't know, but I'm going to find out. Thank you for believing in her and us. I've been living a nightmare. I'll do everything I can. There, there. Welcome home. Are you all right? I'm okay. Are you? I'm excited to hear what you found out today. Okay, then let's get on with it. Yeah, let's talk the case. Start with the general primer. What's the connection between the girls? They all work at the fight together. Well, that's, the, that's a great find. How do you know? Why is that important? We always lose them for Clarissa, so do we know anything about Rose that sheds light on it all? She's right, she's Clarissa's right hand woman for the VIP. She the guy that sends an event to on desk for Clarissa. What kind of information was Rose able to collect? Plenty on the ones that matter. Fancy folks with VIP full privileges, you mean exactly in lower class, no names like Carissa New. But New, no one would miss or kill it off the flesh, right? Even folks like the police chief and sick, plenty of science city workers. It's ingenuous set up to be fair and don't leave me in suspense. Did you find out any of the intel? Yeah, especially on a senior scientist named Eddie Hung. Okay, so what's Eddie's deal? Both him, both his and the minister's files mention Project Artifact. I think it's our next lead. What do you think it is? No idea. Eddie's a biochemist. That's all we know. Wait, is that the same guy from the Science City report we found in the minister's file? Must be genes, proteins, biochemistry. Check this out. We have to look into what this project artifact entails. Clearly, Clarissa is interested in it. Interested in it. Um, uh, I don't know, Renee. Science City is yeah, some serious shit. Did you learn what happened to the girls? Uh, there were hints they escaped the city. The fuck, how? 
someone called Dio smuggled them out. I think that's what they meant. Meet them under the bridge and everything like that. Man, I was sure like to ask the Dio some questions. Same, but I got no leads on them at all. Could there be really be something beyond the wall? This is a lot to process and need a new plan. Damn, there's so so much we don't know. You did great though, especially now that you get killed. <laughs> Feel bad for points now and killing stuff like that, not knowing that asshole skunk was lucky I didn't kill him. Well, go get the answers. Her the answers you deserve. Anyway, let's talk the next step. Are you any hungry? Learning about Project Artifact. Oh, we already got another. It's been all the leads. I'm ready. You want to go over the facts, get everything straight in your head. So you can never be too prepared. Good. All right, I'm about to do this. I need to recap and make sure I understand everything that's going on. Good. Uh, let's go. To, let's start with what we know about Clarissa. She's in cahoots with the science ministers. Love spying on everyone. Knows about the product project artifact. Um. That's her end game, most likely leveraging her relationship with the science minister, minister to protect her own influence and power. Uh, the missing girls, they got out beyond the fucking wall, and they were being used as spies and drug pushers. Uh, how did Clarissa let them go so easily? Anyway, that's not a pri priority right now. Uh, the science city something important to the science ape and Clarissa's going down there. We need to see for ourselves Biochemistry research. Yeah, the documents mentioned the proteins. That's high-level stuff. We need specifics You pay Eddie a visit at the Science City and find the answers, then we'll get the word out. The rest is up to the general public. So you can get into Science City. Your employer is a little charm. Oh yeah, sure, charm my way to. No, excuse me. Charm my sure. Oh yeah, sure. Charm my way into the top secret lab. Their sarcasm is noted and not appreciated. Just do whatever it takes. It'll be our biggest chance to corner Clarissa. You make it sound so simple. Fundamentally, it is. You're a good detective. You'll figure it out. Oh, we could destroy Clarissa now. You want to become a failed assassin? Do it after the Science City. Uh, let's see. You want something back? Before I do anything, I need to eat and sleep. You'll sleep when you're dead. Oh, go grab something at the bodega. Put your feet up until I'm back. You earned it for once. Sure, be safe. All right, with that, I am going to end it right there. We'll be picking up that phone call. Well, I guess not. All right, well, with that right there, I'm going to end it. Uh, I'm going to call it. And uh, don't forget to do me a favor and share, like, subscribe. And I'll see you on the next episode of Backbone. This game is pretty good. It's getting real juicy. And I'm still not sure about them girls escaping. But we'll see as this game progresses. Alright. Deuces.